DeepSeek has uploaded a new model, V3.1 and a base model, not an instruct model, a base model, which you can use to do fine tuning further, but you can't chat with the model. This seems like DeepSeek is teasing us because this model seems like exact same copy of the previous one that they released v3 so this is possibly a new model but using the same architecture same configuration but extended data that is what the speculation is at this point deep seek has not given any information there is no model card at all like as you can see here the model card is empty but if you go to the files and versions and if you click config.json you would see this config.json is exactly same like the deep seek v3 model for those who are not familiar with the base model concept deep seek r1 was trained on top of DeepSeek v3. So the v3 base model comes first and then based on that they'll do post training and then they have the reinforcement learning post trained model which was r1 and then we can probably expect r2. But a lot of speculation on internet suggests that you may not expect r2 immediately because one first of all this is DeepSeek v3.1 base model and it has the same configuration like the previous one but then if you see the rumors there are like some API endpoints that has leaked or people have gotten access to and based on that if I translate this Chinese table to English then you see that this new model has no improvement whatsoever um, when you compare it with the previous one v30324 the model that was launched on March two, 2024 so this one seems like no improvement at all so uh, even if it has got more data, uh, the model doesn't seem to be doing better on benchmarks. As you can see here, it seems to be very similar. The only catch here is that uh, that uh, DeepSeek seems to be getting into a hybrid model mode. What does it mean? It means instead of having a separate thinking and non-thinking model, DeepSeek in an anthropic style, it might have one model that can invoke both thinking and non-thinking based on the settings, based on the question and all those things. So it like, the rumor suggests that we might expect V4, not R2. So if you're expecting R2, if you're getting speculations, rumors that DeepSeek R2 is going to be launched, then this is something for you to think about. So either way, I think this is uh, this is just something that DeepSeek is teasing us. Maybe DeepSeek V4 might come, but not DeepSeek R2. The only thing that you can probably be interested in at this particular point is that when you see the collection update, you can see within DeepSeek V3.1, there are two items, but when you go inside it, you can see only one item. So there are again speculations and rumors that DeepSeek V3.1's instruct model might also get launched not just the base model but right now as of now it's all speculation we don't have any information but I just wanted to give you the details around what kind of things people are discussing and what you can make out of it like uh, the only thing that people currently know is this model might have an efficient reasoning like slightly better reasoning so it might use lesser tokens it might uh, cost you less to run but ideally it is the same model um, maybe more data but the same model so let me know what you think are you looking forward to deep seek v4 or are you looking forward to deep seek r2 or you are like moved out of the deep seek universe and then into the kimis of the world or glm 4.5s of the world see you in another video happy prompting